Howdy peeps, how's it going? Hope everyone's been doing okay. I've been doing really well myself. It's been about two months, I think, since my last official vlogging, part of which was due to the uh, time I took trying to make the 100th video. I actually did have some pretty big plans for that video, which included um, myself and my coworkers and my parents and stuff like that but unfortunately those plans didn't exactly work out and I ended up uh, making a slightly lower key video instead but it was okay because I ended up making a video that I was wanting to make for quite a while and that was a video about my back history you know just all the stuff that uh, occurred prior to all the videos that I made and so I was finally able to make that video and of course, uh, July has been a really busy month itself, as you guys could see from all the videos that I posted that month. Uh, I did the camping for about, um, I guess about five days, about uh, three weeks ago. And of course, I have been doing a whole bunch of uh, meetup.com related events. I may have uh, mentioned, I don't know if it was like either the last vlog I did or... Uh, a vlog before that, but I may have mentioned recently how I joined the website uh, meetup.com. I was actually originally on there in the anime group hoping to attend anime related events, but I decided to do a little bit of scouring around. I uh, initially specifically looked for uh, uh, ballroom dancing related events, and sure enough, I did. I found um, two groups that were there. And uh, I joined both of them and attended events that were related to both of them. And um, I've really been having a great time with that. Uh, I think one of the first ballroom events that I attended was probably, may have been about a month, like a month or two ago, at a place called the Rowing Club in Vancouver. And it's a, it was just basically a, ball, a ballroom dancing event. It was one of the first events that I attended that wasn't uh, related to my dance school so it was really nice to be out there I got to meet actually I was really surprised by it because there were so many young people there and of course um, at my ballroom dance schools it's usually like a lot of old people so you can imagine uh, how excited I was to finally be able to dance with younger people like younger ladies and so that that was really fun I think uh, after that, you know, I went to a, we went to a hotel to dance, and um, they had like a, a hotel which had um, a ballroom dance floor and a restaurant in it, and then that was fun. And then, of course, you guys saw the cruise video that I went on. That was actually a a meetup related bar, uh, a meetup related event as well. And so, the, actually, there's also been other uh, events that I've been attending. Uh, I joined. A couple of other groups. I joined a fine dining group, which basically just go out and just eat good food. You know, go out to um, to a restaurant. I joined another one that was like a sushi lovers group, where you eat sushi, and that's that's something I did about three weeks, about two or three weeks ago, and something I would probably be doing this weekend as well, or might be doing this weekend. I think the website's probably been around for about three or four years and I'm surprised it hasn't been around for longer considering how many people really need a website like this especially someone like myself considering that I always have trouble making social connections but also I'm always looking for really cool things to do I originally thought that maybe Facebook would be the gold mine for stuff like that but and actually I did find a couple of really cool events through Facebook such as the uh, water fight and the zombie walk but it wasn't really enough it wasn't exactly what I was looking for as I was indeed trying to f to find a more social connect means of making more social connections with people and I mean apart from uh, the zombie walks the only other events on uh, Facebook are stuff like um, Billy's 15th birthday Sally's 16th birthday Bobby's 19th birthday you know just like a whole bunch of private events that are being displayed publicly and they're cluttering uh, Facebook's event section so I'm really glad for a uh, website like this as it's been really helping me to do 
a lot of really cool things I wouldn't normally be able to do without it. In fact, I'll, I am quite possibly going to be overtaking the uh, anime uh, group that they have on there, like the anime group I mentioned before, since the uh, organizer on the website has apparently given up the ghost, and so there's about 150 people in this group that need cool stuff to do, and so... Uh, anime Evolution is uh, coming next week. In fact, as, as a matter of fact, uh, my last week of vacation is coming next week too. And so what I was going to do is probably set up an event through the website. And um, and like once I've finally t overtaken the anime group, I probably set up an event for the Anime Evolution and just, you know, meet up with people at the uh, Anime Evolution. And so that should be really awesome. And I was also thinking uh, having video nights so people could come over, I guess, either to my place or to someone else's place and watch videos. Um, I still haven't decided exactly... Well, actually, I could have, like, uh, dinners as well. Like, have anime people come together for, like, dinners as well. Um, as for other events, I'm not exactly sure what else I could do with the group. But, you know... There's, uh, I guess the sky's the limit in terms of the types of things that I could do. So I guess with attending all these meetup events, it could potentially mean an increase in adventure blogging. And of course it means I'll probably be uh, doing more vlogging on the weekends. I mean, the one, um, I, was, I was originally only attending like these meetup events, but once per month. But it seems that uh, these groups are starting to pick up momentum. So uh, I'm actually got stuff that I'm doing every weekend now. So I mean, I guess it means I I will most likely just do all my vlogging during the week, and I'll try and uh, get as much uh, cool video of all the cool stuff that I that I do uh, on the weekends. Speaking of uh, anime evolution, yes, uh, I will be going to that. You guys may have seen my last year last year's videos and if you haven't go to it right now so you can get a general idea as to what it's like. It's basically a celebration of anime and I've got a really cool idea for a costume. It's really hot under that mask but it's it's the costume is going to involve this mask right here and it's going to involve a video game character from a very popular video game. I'm just somewhat cheating a little bit because I'm using a video game character to do it but technically still sticking to the anime theme. You'll see. I'll, sh I'll You'll be really surprised as to what my uh, cosplay costume is going to be. But yes, uh, it should be a really good event and I hope to see uh, the, some of my meetup members there with me. Oh yeah, I just actually wanted to show you guys some cool uh, DVDs that I picked up at a flea market last week. This, uh, this one right here is a Japanese movie called The Machine Girl. And uh, the plot's pretty simple. It's about a lady whose uh, brother dies due to some Yuzuka um, gangsters. And so she also loses her arm. And so what she does is she, uh, met, they give her a machine gun prosthetic and she uses her machine gun prosthetic to kill the baddies in a very extremely violent ways. Uh, it's a very violent movie, but it's hilarious. It's fun. And if you have a sense of humor, and if you like anime, great movie. Great movie. Oh yeah, and if you're not concerned by plot or acting or anything like that, you know, great movie still. And of course we have ourselves Kung Fu Hustle. I'm sure some of you have probably seen this already. Again, great movie. Lots of crazy special effects. Uh, lots of martial arts. Um, lots of great humor. It's by the same guy that did uh, Shallow and Soccer, so it's the same same type of idea. Lots of crazy Matrix-ish, actually Matrix spoof-ish type things going on. So definitely, definitely see this if you haven't already. So um, I think that's about it for now. Um, I'm, did my brother is actually going to come over in a couple minutes to play a, a card game with me. Street Fighter 2, the card game to be exact. He's got like a Chung Lee deck and I got a Dulcim deck. So I hope to see him soon. And I hope to see you guys again soon too. Uh, I will keep you guys up to date on all my little adventures and whatnot. Um, and yeah, that's about, that's about it right now. Um, Anime Evolution coming up next week. Be sure to keep an eye out for that video. And uh, yeah, that's it. 
I'll keep you guys in, keep you guys informed. Yes, yes, I'll keep you guys informed some way, somehow. Anyways, that's it. Bye.